ओम श्री साई राम सी रामा थ्रू साई रामा पर्पस ऑफ द रामा अवतार इन द त्रेता युगा गॉड अपियर्ड एज अ ह्यूमन बींग इन द फॉर्म ऑफ रामा एंड बाई यूजिंग हिज ओन फैमिली एज एन एग्जाम्पल ही ट्राई टू सेट अप एन आइडियल धार्मिक कॉन्डक्ट कैरेक्टरिस्टिक ऑफ दैट एज एट द टाइम इट वॉज ऑल्सो एस्टैब्लिश्ड दैट रामा वॉज द एम्बॉडीमेंट ऑफ लव एंड लक्ष्मणा वॉज द एम्बॉडीमेंट ऑफ कम्पैशन एंड दैट इट वॉज द कॉन्फ्लुएंस ऑफ धर्मा एंड कम्पैशन दैट मेक्स अ गुड ह्यूमन बींग दिस इज ट्रू धर्मा वी आर बिलीविंग दैट रिचुअल्स कॉन्स्टिट्यूट धर्मा इट इज नॉट आवर डेली प्रैक्टिस और रिचुअल्स दैट कॉन्स्टिट्यूट ट्रू धर्मा इट इज द कम्पैशन that is generated in a pure heart that constitutes the base of a true dharma this is also the most important basic quality of a human being one must make an attempt to follow the dictates of one's own conscience by such conduct and example ramachandra corrected all of humanity who is rama rama is the indweller in every body He is the source of bliss, the Atma Rama, in every individual. His blessings, upsurging from the inner spring, can confer peace and bliss. He is the very embodiment of Dharma in all codes of morality and holds mankind together in love and unity. The Ramayana, the story of Rama, teaches two lessons. One. the value of detachment and the need to become aware of divinity in every being two faith in god and detachment from objective pursuits are the key for human liberation the power of rama's name rama's name is the life giving essence of the two great mantras the term rama has another esoteric significance it consists of three syllables ra plus a plus ma ra signifies agni the fire god a represents surya the sun god ma represents chandra the moon god the combination of the three letters constitutes the rama name ra representing the fire god burns away all sins a representing the sun god dispels the darkness of ignorance and ma representing the moon god cools one's temper and produces tranquility the name rama has the triple power of washing away one's sins removing one's ignorance and calming one's mind how is the profound meaning of the sacred name to be imparted to mankind this can be done only by the divine coming in human form and demonstrating to mankind the power of the divine rama's name signifies the harmony in thought word and deed rama demonstrated this harmony by his thoughts words and deeds the rama principle embodies numerous powers and potencies The Ramayana is not a sacred text to be used only for ritualistic reading or parayanam. The Rama principle is an all-pervading like the cosmic spirit. In olden times, people used to say that their inner secrets are known only to the indwelling Rama spirit, the Atma Rama. The self is called Rama. Rama means one who pleases. How can you give a specific form to one who pleases or delights? Swami explains how to celebrate Rama's life. The Ramayana has been described as the story of a man who is an example of idealness. One must discover and find out for oneself whether those ideals of Rama are within him or not. Ramayana speaks of individual responsibilities family obligations and social responsibilities 
The Ramayana establishes the truth that the unity of all of these is the Rama Tattwa. Though thousands of years have passed, Ramayana is happening every moment, even to this day. The nature of Rama is most essential for every individual. Every individual must believe that they are Rama, who is the very embodiment of idealism. That Atma that gives bliss is the form of Rama. In this world, there is no one without a heart that is, after all, bliss. Therefore, in the spiritual path, if we investigate, Rama is not a separate individual. Dasharatha means this body, which is the chariot for the ten senses. The five cognitive senses and the five senses of action together form this body. The four sons represent the four objectives of life. Dharma, Artha, Kama, Moksha, Righteousness, Wealth, Desire, and Liberation. Ravana was after Artha, Kama, and Moksha, giving up Dharma. Ravana was highly educated and knew 64 forms of knowledge. Rama only knew 35. But Rama practiced all that he learned, and Ravana didn't. There is always a conflict between righteousness and unrighteousness, truth and falsehood. It is out of love that righteousness springs. Therefore, the embodiment of satya and dharma is verily the embodiment of love. It is only man that goes astray from dharma. We must gather that which is forgotten. The piety must be protected. The man behaves like an animal and demon. Let us not think that Ramayana is merely history. We must consider it as the very life principle in every individual. First, we should know this. And then after that, we can conduct ourselves accordingly. We must understand the principle of Rama and practice it. In spite of doing all sadhana, if there is no change in the human mind, all that is useless. We must believe that the mind is the cause. For that, the divine name is the basis. Swami materialized Rama era Mother Sita's brooch and a medallion that showed how Rama looked like before his coronation. In the year 1999, Swami took the devotees to the hilltop bungalow blessing and blessed many devotees with many photographs of him. Later, he materialized a diamond brooch in the shape of a rose with two leaves. This brooch was Mother Sita's. He showed it all around to the devotees and wore it on his robe near his heart. During lunch, Swami had the brooch wrapped up in a handkerchief and all the devotees saw it again before long this shining object disappeared. Another day, Swami asked a senior devotee to speak and when the talk was going on, rain poured down. Swami paused the talk and asked the students to sing bhajans. When one student sang a Rama bhajan, Swami materialized a medallion with Rama in it with his bow and described it as how Rama appeared before he was about to be coronated. It is not enough merely to celebrate Rama Navmi as the birthday of Sri Rama. You should understand the purpose of his birth and practice the ideals he demonstrated. Rama Kalyana does not mean the marriage of Rama and Sita at the physical level. Rama Kalyana is Atma Kalyana. It signifies the merging of the Atma, the individual soul, with the Paramatma, the universal soul. This is not a story of an individual. Rama symbolizes the cosmic and universal spirit. Sairam. Rama Kodanda Rama Rama Patavi Rama Rama Kalyana Rama Ragava Rama Rama, Rama, Rama. 
ಕಲ್ಯಾಣ ರಾಮ ಚಿಂತನೆ ಚಾಲು ನೀ ನಾಮ ಮೇಲು ನೀ ಚಿಂತನೆ ಚಾಲು ಮಾತಾಡು ರಾಮ